beloved friend, if you are looking for what to pack for Panama, this is the video for you. I'm gonna be sharing with you my outfits for Panama, what I'm bringing. I'm gonna share with you something that I was about to miss bringing and I think is going to be a lifesaver as we get to Panama. We are going on vacation. We're gonna be spending 12 days there and we're gonna do surf camp for the first week and then Panama City for the second week. So I'm excited for it. Part of the time is going to be spent a lot in the beach and just very leisure and doing lots of like gym classes and surf lessons. And then the other part is going to be doing the touristy thing in Panama City. So I'm going to be packing things that are practical, uh, a leisure wear, and lots of bathing suits. Definitely not an expert at packing for Panama, but I am an expert at packing and I am an expert of style and bringing something that is actually going to work for your whole trip. I want to invite you to pick a color mood before you start packing. My color mood is very neutral. I have pretty much all beige, blacks, whites, and reds. And I picked a few things that were blue, like a really beautiful blue dress. Uh, picking a color mood is going to be super helpful to your packing and knowing that you have the things that you have in your suitcase are sort of this capsule wardrobe that helps you know that you can mix and match things as you are on your trip. Okay, let's get to it. The first thing I'm gonna do is put all the things that I would hate to lose on my carry-on. And I put a good amount of clothes that I would be really sad if I saw get lost. And I put all my valuables in my carry-on suitcase. and packing cubes because everything is nice and folded. my space is by purse inception so I'm going to show you what I mean I put my purses inside my purses inside my purses <laughs> and I like to bring hats that are collapsible I often find very helpful when you buy say a, a straw hat to, to make sure that it's able to fold up so they can fold it into your uh, luggage and it'll be fine by the time that you get there I have these little water bags that I got and I'm going to put those Inside of this one. Okay, see what I mean? Bag inside a bag. And then put that inside the bag. And then put the swimsuit inside of that. So that fits nicely in there. I know I'm not damaging the bag. And I can clip this on here. There we go. We're also going to fit this little guy into this little concave space. I like to put flat shoes at the very edge, like this, and this. Okay, I think that is it for that. I got these shoes to run on the beach in Panama, and these are the shoes that I'm going to bring on the flight with me. So these are going to be my airport shoes. Another thing that you need for Panama definitely is a water shoe for the activities that you might be doing. way in advance which is kind of good but then kind of bad because then sometimes I forget certain things so for the things that I'm going to need for life for the next couple weeks I'm going to put in this little bucket and I'm going to keep those as my I need to pack these but 
they still need to be in use for every day or I'm going to pack these in my personal item and I don't necessarily have the capacity to pack that right now. So I've got this little guy and I'm just going to put everything in there. This little guy is so cute. It's a lint roller, you guys. Literally the cutest thing in the entire world. If you're traveling and you're like, ooh, I got a little lint. Mm, not anymore, okay? You're good. And you have your little... I feel like it's like a Pokemon egg, right? Does this look like a Pokemon egg to you? Let me put my Pokemon egg there. I got this little guy for pills. This little guy is glowing. Floss. I never have too much floss. Q-tips. Wet ones. This mirror that has lead light and I could just came with a little charger, so I'm gonna make sure that I keep that. I'm gonna keep all the little chargers in this guy. A little charger for something. Got these beach towels that are super soft and very lightweight. Everyone's gonna get their own to carry in their own luggage. I'm gonna pack these in a couple of Ziploc bags. I have this pill organizer for my vitamins. My friend gave me this adorable little guy for my passport. I can't wait to use it. I'm taking my makeup brushes in this little bag and I'm gonna show you how adorable it is. Okay, so you put your makeup brushes, you pack them. Okay, obviously I'm gonna pack a little bit more brushes than that, but I want you to see at this cutie pieness of a thing. Close it up like this. It's nice. It has this little mesh thing to have your brushes breathe because you definitely don't want to have your brushes be, you know, nasty and bacteria-y. So they want to be able to have breathing room. But this folds up nicely, so it's going to fit nicely in the luggage. And when we get to Panama, watch this. You open it up like that. Kaboom. It's a little stand for your stinking makeup brushes. This is genius. Whoever invented this is a genius. But my brushes are the one thing that I cannot pack until the day of. And I like to wash them all with a really nice disinfectant before I go and travel. So I wash them the night before and I let them air dry overnight and then I pack them up. I'm gonna pack all my makeup in this little guy. It's really nice because it has this it has a diagonal opening, which when you open the bag, it lays flat so you can see everything that you have in there. I got this little guy for any of my makeup that I want to bring or serums or whatever. Um, I'm going to fill these up with something. <laughs> the skincare that I really love and appreciate and I will say that all of my skincare is going to be used by my entire family so I'm taking a lot of sunscreen 
I'm taking the Sun Visor by Save Beauty because it's a must. And I put some of my favorite skincare that I didn't have in little form or in smaller form into little receptacles. I'm bringing some masks. Definitely bringing a lot of sunscreen. And I saw this at Sephora. Isn't this the cutest little thing you've ever seen? It's so small and I'm going to be able to put this in my bag. It's definitely my favorite body wash. Um, oh, and I'm bringing little razors for my face. Or like little shading things for my face. And I'm bringing my favorite eye cream. This little guy, it, I think is going to be a great travel outfit, especially to Panama because it's going to be hot when we get there, but I still wanted to feel comfy in on the airplane. And I still am trying to think like, is this a good idea to wear shorts on an airplane? But uh, we shall see. I don't know. But I love it. The fabric is so cozy. It's so warm. So I bought this little thing from my jewelry. I love that it has little compartments for your earrings. This guy clip like this and you put your necklace that is so handy this is so handy oh and even better you can put it in there so it doesn't tangle whoa buddy this is good this is a really good little thing um, I'm gonna fill it up with more stuff but as you can see right here you can do rings and then you secure and clip it with bracelets in there so it has this little compartment for oh you can put some stuff in here okay so I like earrings okay oh my gosh this is so good so then you close it up like this this one I'll be stashing in my carry-on okay oh we're almost there got umbrella cute little hat so I make a list, a very detailed list of the things that I haven't put in my suitcase because I like to, because I love to pack early. I want to make sure that I'm being diligent. So I make a very detailed list of the things that I have not yet put in the suitcase. So I'm going to go do that right now and I'm going to finish packing tomorrow. The next thing that is a must pack for your Panama trip are mosquito repellent goodies you can get either a spray or you can get something like this i bought these mosquito repellent bracelets now i haven't tried before and i don't know if they're gonna work but we're gonna give them a shot i also bought i bought a battery for my phones i have a slim and compact wireless magnetic mini air charger and that is going to be a saving grace i'm sure when my phone runs out of battery i hope this video helped you with your packing if you're packing to panama city have a really beautiful trip i love you so much i can't wait to hear about your trip let me comment down below let me know how your trip was i would love to know